Hoop Ball presents NBA regular season record chasing with Eli Sussman. Hey everybody, welcome to the second episode of Hoop Ball's new video series. Here on regular season record chasing, we're out to prove that every team is on the verge of something historic. This is about so much more than triple doubles and unicorns. There are unique players and playing styles all across the NBA, from lottery teams to NBA Finals contenders, and they've made the 2016-17 season one for the record books. On this episode, let's get to know the Phoenix Suns. One of the first things you notice about the Suns is just how young they are. The NBA's second youngest head coach, Earl Watson, two members of their starting lineup going through this season below the legal drinking age, nearly half of their total minutes being allocated to guys 23 and under, and the single youngest player in the league. So that's where we'll begin, with Dragon Bender. He's currently sidelined following ankle surgery, but before that injury, Bender had settled into the Suns rotation and left a lot to be desired on the offensive end. He owns a 37.1 field goal percentage, a 32.1 three-point percentage, and a 37.5 free throw percentage. That earns him entry into the exclusive Sub-40, Sub-40, Sub-40 club as the youngest player ever to struggle so much in all three of those categories in the same season. On the opposite end of the efficiency spectrum, Tyson Chandler. Now there's a veteran who knows his role and embraces it now more than ever. About 90% of Chandler's field goal attempts this season have come from inside three feet and nearly half of his makes have been dunks. Such careful shot selection has boosted his overall field goal percentage to the top spot in franchise history. Chandler's presence as an expert rim runner elevates the play of his teammates too. Phoenix averages 128 points per 100 possessions with him on the court, a single season franchise record for offensive rating. That's a serious accomplishment when you're sharing a uniform that once belonged to Steve Nash, Amari Stoudemire, and those revolutionary 7 seconds or less sons. Chandler almost always shares the floor with Devin Booker, who in his second NBA season has already shown the ability to get buckets in a variety of ways. Having just turned 20 in October, he's comfortably on pace to become the youngest guard ever to average 20 points per game in a season. But just as you probably expected, our featured stat comes from an underrated, undersized, thick-bodied all-star snub, Allen Williams. Spending the lion's share of his minutes at center on a team with Chandler and Alex Len means that he rarely gets off the bench. But when those opportunities come knocking, the Suns unleash one of the most dominant rebounders the sport has seen in generations. Since debuting last March, Williams is pulling down more than a quarter of all available boards. Total rebound percentage has been tracked by basketball reference dating back to the 1970-71 season. In all that time, no player with significant NBA experience even comes close to Big Sauce. On the next episode, I'll take a closer look at the Los Angeles Lakers. Find me on Twitter, at RealEli. Keep up with our daily podcast by downloading the HoopBall Radio mobile app. And find all of our great content at HoopBall.com.